Alright, so once I see the stream started, okay, so our screen is centered. Um, I was going to try to do the Devotress day one, but um, I'm not getting saves to move over correctly. I got a couple to move over, but for some reason I couldn't get all of them. Um, so I'll have to try it again later. I do know that it works. They're just uh, not loading in properly for some reason. Not all of my saves, so I'll have to figure out if it's the naming scheme or what. But I should be able to move over an end day save um, from a previous playthrough to uh, be able to unlock the Devotress's path so we can play it at the same time. Um, but for today we will just uh, see uh, what Barack is up to for day three. And that's just fine. Yeah, glad that uh, everybody's flexible on this. <laughs> so, we just have to decide. Um, Um, day three, I can't think of what quests we have. So, I don't think we've gotten any letters yet for day three. Um, Yeah, for some reason, um, the stream is saying that I'm not, um, streaming. Twitch is, uh, not cooperating. Not at all. So, um, not sure what's going on there. Oh, Twitch isn't responding at all, so that might be part of it. Yeah, hopefully it does just write itself. <laughs> At least I can still see comments, so... <laughs> but it says that no one's online. And uh, it wasn't showing my stream for a little bit. But I could hear the audio, so I wasn't sure if something was uh, up or not. <laughs> mm. I just had all kinds of issues today. As long as I had no issues with mapping, that's uh, my big one today. I uh, well, I guess I had one issue. I don't have the park or young vlads or like anything like around that area correct on my map but as far as the rest of it went it looks great so I'm pretty happy with the way that it turned out and I can't wait to start eventing and actually like get some of the gameplay in so we can start testing it um, I found a save but um, for some reason only some of them would load in, so I'm gonna have to play with that later and see if I can get the other ones to show up, because I was going by the dates, so I got several that were from like January or February, and I couldn't get any of the ones from March, because I assume if I have a Devotress, 
save that it'll probably unlock it as well. So I found a Devotress save that I'm gonna try, and if not, um, on my laptop I can transfer over um, some uh, saves from there and uh, get my end game uh, save from one of Daniel's run throughs and uh, I can move that over worst case scenario if just having the Devotress save doesn't unlock her path. Which I'm assuming it will, but I'm not really sure, so we'll see. Um, either way, I have plenty of endgame saves, and I've moved them from computer to computer before and had it work, so... I've even done it in different copies of the HD version on a friend's computer so we could play the Devotress's Path, so... Um, I should be able to get it working. Eventually. Uh. Oh, he can hit me from there. That sucked. I almost want to go back. I didn't realize he was hitting me that whole time. Um, and the kidneys do serve a purpose. They, uh... We can trade them to worms for twire, which I don't know if I'll need any additional twire in this run through. But, uh. <laughs> look both ways before you punch someone to death. I am very low on health. <laughs> Always. I don't know why I, I just tend to run around very low on health, like all the time. I just never want to use my bandages if I don't have to. And I always feel like I don't have to. I should run around all of the um, tailor shops and uh, Collect all the needles. I don't know if I've been in any yet today. I don't think we did any of that last night. Now I have to save because I got three needles there. I didn't like that I saved. It's been crying after I saved sometimes lately. Never had that happen before. I wonder if they added like a every three saves your reputation goes down or something but that's uh, kind of weird my hunger and exhaustion are actually pretty low Free watch. I'll take the blood too, since I have to carry it around anyway. I probably should have been t picking up all the organs that I've been finding, but I haven't been, so... Oh, for a second I thought I saw a thug out there. I guess not. Oh, there's one. That's a fun cue. I don't know from how far away they can see me. I wonder if Anna's stairs work. I've never tried. I kinda want to. Kinda curious. Come 
come over this way. <laughs> he can reach me. This is an issue. can't reach each other. <laughs> As the thug that never <laughs> dies. <laughs> oh, I'll take the blood too. Um, oh yeah, our reputation's full, so I don't have to worry about murdering sorry souls. As I find them walking around. I could murder ladies too if I wanted to. I'd get free uh, trading items so I should be murdering them. What's wrong with me? Why didn't I do that before? Yeah the fighting is uh, pretty spectacular in this game. Um, on playthroughs where I'm just playing um, by myself and I don't care how many times I die doing things. Um, I usually would do a lot of the fighting. Um, the way you're supposed to. Not standing on staircases <laughs> exploiting uh, silliness like that. But uh, it's a lot easier this way, I don't get hurt, I can get more money for bandages, and we can try to, uh... We can try to, uh... something. Words. Oh, and we can, uh... I forgot what I was saying. I've just completely forgotten. I remembered and then I forgot again. <laughs> Oh, we can try to get the mili full mi military garb. That's important. This is a Savi. I'm not going to pick it up. Oh, this blood cloud isn't there yet. Excellent. That plague cloud sure there. And we'll wander around um, for a while. Killing thugs and uh, then I'll try to get back to uh, what we probably should be doing. Which is uh, nothing at this hour. Actually I might be able to start Capella's quest early. Um, we'll see. Hmm. I guess I do remember one of the quests for day three. Before, I could not remember any of them. And then all of a sudden, Capella has a quest today. My poor brain. Um, it'll stay there. It's, it's not like it's gonna run away and uh, I don't want to clutter up my inventory. We'll be back around Saparov's at some point um, where I can grab it, but I also am just not a huge fan of using that kind of twire, so I only use it if I run out of everything else. I'll usually just stick to uh, the few recipes that I do need to be able to uh, do need blah 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 uh, that I don't need. I'll stick to the few recipes that I don't need sabis for. I should go buy some black twire, I guess. <laughs> do -do 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 -do. No one saw anything. 
too. I'll grab the blood too. Ooh, hazelnuts. And another guy to murder. Yay! <laughs> and a drunk to trade with. Even more yay. Crackers. I'm gonna eat those. Hello, Mr. Drunk. We're out of water now. Doobly going to save. Hmm. I used to go out in the night only to be found someplace new in the morning. Yeah, those are, uh, they're just, um, guys who probably would, uh, become plague victims in the coming days. Um, they'll ask you for money and you can give them some money so they can allegedly go buy pills and twiren to try and uh, help their situation. Has it been hard on you lately? Why the sad look? I've been feeling dizzy again. I had a pit. I felt that Notkin was in danger. Have the two of you met yet? He lives at the warehouses. Their castle is there. A pit? What's that? Well, that's what Maria and I call our visions. She calls her a, hers a flight and I call mine a pit. That's peculiar because mine are usually joyful while hers are grim. Or maybe it's just me. So will you check on Notkin? How do I find them? It's by the southern warehouses. That's where the soul and a halves, that's what they're calling themselves, live. He's not an urchin, he's just independent and parentless. And he is getting out of hand. Maybe you could go and check on him. What if he is indeed in danger? Sure, I'll check. Okie doke. Um, that might actually be... Now, there are very few quests that I would skip, but I think... I can't remember. No, I think... Does Daniel give you the quest today that I usually skip? Ugh. Well, there's a quest that I'm going to skip today. Oh, you know what I do have to do today? What? I just remembered. Um, I have to kill a Pleggy. So, I will be going back to Savarov's later. Trade goods. Do do do. Kill ladies in the middle of the night. That's another Billy Joel song. In the middle of the night. Do do. Mm I'm not near any stairs. Mm, probably not a good time to look at the uh, other screen. I'm gonna run around and try to pick up another bug while I'm at it. all dual purpose here. Oh, 
Oh, that one. Yeah, that one totally. I thought he would run the other way around the tree, and he did not. So... What was the last thing we did? Did I talk to Capella yet? I don't even remember. I don't know. I'll have to see. Okay, I did talk to her. I think this time I'll go toward uh, Julia's house or someone that I can uh, kill thugs closer to uh, where I can be closer to a place where I can kill thugs. That sentence. <laughs> oh, don't want that guy to see me uh, murdering people. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, the guy, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I definitely do that a lot too, where if I don't feel like fighting something or dodging a plague cloud or running away from a rat. Yes, that is another Billy Joel song. <laughs> We'll see how many we can reference today. I'm sure there's another one in me. I just picked up a ton of great items, oh my goodness. I'm gonna save outside, which I normally don't like to do. Cause there's also a guy up here that I can murder. A drunk that I can trade with. And there's a thug around the corner. Okay. I'll come back for that thug. <laughs> Murder has its orders. Priorities. We're gonna save before this thug. Ah! <laughs> For that very reason. <laughs> and so we could keep that money we got from that one guy. Whoops. <laughs> Almost died. I keep hearing things. Oh, there's another guy I can murder. After I kill this thug. Oh, there's another one. Oh, and good, he saw me. Excellent. Oops. What are they doing? They're like stuck on each other stupidly. No, no, no. a little bit over here because I don't want you to fall on top of your twin. Mm. Mm, it's starting to rain. This 
So there's a Billy Joel song called We Didn't Start the Fire. And that's my next one. We didn't start the fire. And start the fire. Mm. Okay, I have to hunt down that one guy now. Literally hunting him down. I'm going to murder him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and this is kind of reminding me of yet another Billy Joel song. She can kill that smile, she can do whatever I she can ruin your faith with her casual letters Take what you give her as long as it's free A child but she's always a woman and She takes care of herself She can wait if she wants She's ahead of her time And oh And she never gives up And she never gives up She just changes her mind She'll promise you more than that in an evening She'll carelessly cut you and laugh while you're bleeding well, now you've heard five Billy Joel songs. So, uh... We are, uh, catching you up to speed here. Uh, I'm sure uh, Amazon will uh, thank me for all of the uh, purchases of Billy Joel's greatest hits because of the stream. <laughs> That's not a song by Billy Joel. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> As I murder this lady. I killed her in one punch. That's pretty scary, actually. People shouldn't die from one punch in the back, no matter how sick or female they are. That's just, uh... Doesn't seem correct. <laughs> yeah, that's a song by, by me. <laughs> I'm gonna kill this lady. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna kill this lady. And this guy too. I'm killing bunches of people. Because that's what I like to do. I'm gonna kill this lady. On my stream for you. That went on far too long. <laughs> oh 
why am I killing people again? Because I can't help myself. Twitch, twitch. Um, no, it's it's uh, for the money and uh, ladies uh, hold trinkets. So um, if I murder them, then I can obtain their trinkets to trade with children. And there's another guy over there that I can kill. <laughs> That's uh, literally what that song is. <laughs> I'll have to uh, write down the lyrics when I listen to the clip later so I can just memorize it and sing it every single day. <laughs> No, of course, I don't remember what I said, <laughs> but I will. Okay, I need to um, go kill a couple thugs now to repair my reputation, which is falling quite low now. So there's a thug. Um, I kind of want to talk to that drunk first, so I might go around this way. Unless the thug kills the drunk, then uh, we'll have luck there. And we'll just get whatever the, th the drunk drops after he's murdered. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, he killed him right quick. <laughs> so he didn't get to throw his knife at me. imagine that is exactly what somebody would say if they were punched to death in the back one punch. Oh my goodness, I wonder if I can chase this lady all the way to Lara's. I could have punched her on the way there. Oh, look at all these people that I could be murdering. But I can't because I've got a thug. Because I want to raise my reputation. I wonder if I picked up that other thug or not. See me! Okay, he did. So now we have two. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, I'm glad that the world doesn't work that way. <laughs> There's another person that I can murder. Oh jeez. Can I go around this house? Is it that thug? Uh, he didn't see me though because of the rain. Okay, that one. He saw me that time. So I collected three thugs! Yay! I don't know if they're all here or not. Mm. Mm. Go over a little bit. Nope, nope, nope. Okay. And they all stacked up in a way that I'll be able to harvest all of their organs and items. Can't forget the items. D 
do that. Ba doop, ba doop, ba doop, boop, bop. This trick never does get old. Especially when you have health as low as mine. <gasps> Hazelnuts! We're like really set to get a powder. We better get a powder today. Um. Yes, Barack is the son of a very well respected. Um. Oh, okay. Call him. Very well respected uh, father of medicine. There were two of these guys and a lady somewhere. Yeah, menku, but does that word mean anything to anybody outside of this game? He's like a... I guess somebody described him as a witch doctor. Some kind of shaman folklore, medicine, man. That's probably a good way to describe him. Wow, I just found a whole bunch of items. I think I'll go check what the price of food is and save in this building over here. This very respectful establishment that still accepts my proper business because I killed two thugs. Three thugs. Three thugs. Prices aren't horrible today. They're not great. I might buy this. Uh, oh, I actually have a lot of money. I think I can sell that knife because I acquired a newer, shinier knife. Maybe that was one of the times that I died. Oh no, here's my newer, shinier knife. So I'm going to sell this knife. I have a Twyron extract. Daniel did not take it from me. Yeah, I was gonna say, uh, well I was gonna say that just Barak's path uh, makes you question <laughs> um, what's good and proper, but um, I've been very similar playing as Daniel as well, so... <laughs> oh, and I'll be even worse when I play as Clara, because Clara, I... I'm not afraid to kill anybody just with my bare hands, so... <laughs> Clara, I always go on a guard spree every single day. <laughs> That's like upwards of like 20 guards. Every day. All the days. Clara, it doesn't even take her as many hits to down somebody, so 
A lot of people will die in like two or three hits with their hands. And oh, wow. We went all the way till seven doing this. I can't even believe that. <laughs> That's hysterical. Three in which the Hara Specs uncovers the intricacies of the secret step code at the at a great personal risk. Do 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 personal risk. <laughs> Twenty four hours of death. A day in the life. Wow. Did you see how many hearts and how much blood I have? <laughs> I don't think that the death toll does. <laughs> it wasn't very high. I've killed more people than the plague. <laughs> I think I actually have. See who our letter is from. Oh, Gimski, do pay me a visit. He says at the end of his letter that I didn't read. I guess I'll read it. A new invitation from Vladel Gimski the Older. Incidentally, I've learned of the difficulties you face in figuring out the mysterious subject denoted by the ancient sign. He's talking about the brand, which I think is uh, at Brock's hideout, so we have to go get it. Did Isidore's inheritance make reference to it? I think we have a lot to discuss. Do you pay me a visit? Always at your service, old Gimski. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it was the first time I played as Barak. I just. I went on daily killing sprees. I just thought the game mechanic was so much fun. To just murder people and harvest all their organs. I harvested I harvested them for no reason too. <clears throat> I was just collecting them because I could. One bottle of water to fill up. One. Oh yeah, we're going to old Gimski's. I I should go. I should go do that. So big glad. I think Daniel. We already talked to Capella. And I think um, talking to Notkin when we go talk to him for Capella. I think he gives us the fourth quest. I think there are just four quests for the day. Simon has disappeared. So his death was... another prank? Well, let's not be hasty. In our judgment. That was really delayed at the end. Like, it just sounded like he was trying to catch his breath, but that last bit... The last like two words were really just like delayed for no reason. Not even a dramatic pause, just all came out of nowhere. Most honored Master Barak, or rather Oinan Barak, you will be called that soon, for you are the keeper of knowledge, a warden, a menku, a surgeon, so to say, and even more than that. So have you looked into the matter matter of your inheritance? I have. Nothing is more important to me for me right now. Um, there was a brand, wasn't there? And the documents bearing the same mark that designates a secret name. Indeed, how did you know that? My daughter told me about these doomed children that the deceased used to take care of. I see no point in hiding the truth from you. The brand, this mysterious subject, is marked with... Belongs to secret step... Belongs to the secret step code. Can you read Longmark, the so-called circles or copious brands? 
You mean the hieroglyphic alphabet? I don't know the secret code. The kin does. Maybe some of the Odong worms or the butchers. And I have to admit, it is me who stands between you and these secrets. I've locked up all the inhabitants of the termitary. Why? Pray forgive me. There... Uh, there is an epidemic? A quarantine. I cannot violate, violate it. There are about 8,000 inside. What if the disease finds a way in? What if it already has? Most respected bachelor Denkovsky has already harassed me with these pointless questions. If the disease is already inside, then there's all the more reason to keep the door shut. But ev enough about that. I want to help you. You know the meaning of the brand, don't you? I do. A few butchers managed to escape the termitary before it was blocked off. I propose a deal. I've explained to you how you may find them helpful, so you will be looking for them anyway. After you find them, tell me where they are. If you promise to do so, I'll tell you where to start. I agree. There is a shack. I've tried to send people over there already. They were greeted coldly. A certain lady lives in it. She is always in the loop. She knows the butcher's ways and what they're after. They say she was begotten by an Odong and a Twyron bride. Start off there. She will treat you with respect. How come? Well, you're Isidore Barak's son, the eldest Barak now. It means a lot to them that you come. You are from a Menku family. Menku aren't just a cert aren't just surgeons or butchers, they're healers. Almost, an almost sacred role, a spiritual one, so to say. All in all, the lady will honor your request and tell you about the runaways. Well, if that is enough, I'm going. Show me the place. Okie doke. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna leave no one left alive. Which is what the master of the Himura family says repeatedly as he comes after you in Fatal Frame. Hmm. Okay, the brand. So, I should probably go get the brand. Um, I should trade first, so I have, um, the other two places. One is the abattoir, the apiary, oh, you definitely should, um, the Fatal Frame games are excellent. Um, I definitely like the first one the best of the three of them, but the second one is has a really great story, and the third one is just worth playing because of the additions that they made to the game mechanics. So it's just fun. It's They added a lot to the third one, so uh... There's just... oh, the third one. It's just kind of endless. Um, I think I might go through this step. Did I have to talk to young Vlad for any reason? I don't know. But I'm gonna talk to Notkin. I'm gonna stop by the plants. Oh, I wanted to trade some items away. Because I don't have any space. Oh, I have one space. Excellent. Um, I haven't played the fourth one. Um, I was part of a very large petition online to bring the fourth one to us in English on the PlayStation 2 long ago. Um, there's a thug there. He's supposed to be there. But, uh... Oh, I don't have very many bullets at all. Really? I refuse to accept that. Um, there's the abattoir and the apiary. The abattoir is now the termitary. Mm. 
Are there two? I thought there were two. Mm. And that's how you shoot people to death. Like a boss. Yeah? Actually, I wonder, how did you manage to sneak in? Freeze. Parlay? Calm down, I will do you no harm. And where are the crooks? How did they let you through? They're dead, all of them. Cool, did you do it all by yourself? All by myself. Take this weapon, it's handmade. Granddad said it used to be a fouling piece. Well, the hammer's different and the barrel has been somewhat modified. It can use rifle ammo or sh uh, shot cartridge. Shot cartridges. Know where to get those? Help me out here. Ammo is rare. It can be found here and there. Always in small quantities. We've ordered our girls to go out looking for it. You could ask them. They'll probably trade ammo and cartridges for their girly treasures. <laughs> oh, joy. <laughs> Thank you. Clara dropped by. And then my head was like, gone. I can't remember a thing. I don't like his Mickey Mouse voice. All the times we live in. An epidemic. I hope my scouts are back soon. Scheming, are you? Maybe I am. Want to help us out? Depends on what you're up to. I'm up to a good thing. My soul and a halves are sneaking about everywhere, watching out for enemy dog heads, catching halves, and just generally messing around. So I want to use them for the greater good. Even Sticky will turn green with envy. What kind of greater good? We will scout out which houses have been infected. We'll make a map of them every day. Imagine that. If it goes well, the bachelor himself will happily trade his right arm for such a map. Hardly, unless someone lends you a hand. We can even make a copy for you if you want. Can you do us a favor in return? What kind of favor? Your father knew some awesome rare recipes for twyron infusions. He wrote down the ones that protected from the sand plague after the first outbreak. Can you make them? I haven't got the hang of it. How many? Give us ten protective mixtures and the map is yours. And don't think I'm being greedy. I just need the infusions to equip the scouts with. No, it's a hard task that would take too much time. So I said no. How do I fix my legs? Don't hang around in the streets for no good reason, okay? Um, I do not like to do that quest. It's not worth it to trade. Um, ten infusions. That's a lot of twire. I'm being chased. So I don't want to get stuck here. Very easy to get stuck here. Oh, wow. Ah, I missed him. Good job. Jeez, there are a ton of them out. Looking for Notkin. Oh, I picked up a silver ring. I don't think I have enough bullets for two, actually. We'll see. We'll see what I can do here. Mm. 
Oh, only one of them followed me? I thought I had both of them. Hmm. I don't really want to waste that bullet, especially since I don't think I have any more. But I think I'm just going to play on. Sweet boys. Do you need some ginger water? <laughs> um, what time is it? Let me see if he needs to be fed, maybe. Oh yeah, he ate at 5.40. It's, it's 9.10. Yeah. Yeah. I need to see if I can get my pup to stop whining. He is very unhappy. Hi, puppy doo. The delicious ginger water. <laughs> no. I might have to take a break for like 15 minutes and go feed him. Because this, uh, this cry might not be sati satiated by ginger water this time. It's only been three and a half hours and he should uh he should go for four or five hours between feedings at this point, but he uh sometimes he uh can't wait. <laughs> He's like trying to eat the syringe. <laughs> yeah, you that was too much. <laughs> you, you, you got too much. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to take a break. <laughs> Alright, I'll be back in like 15 minutes.
pup is being fed. Yeah, I, I'm pretty good for uh, memorizing maps. It's just like how my brain works. I just like to... I can very easily remember directions and uh, layouts and I like to draw out maps and landscapes and things like that so that's just like something my brain just like retains really easily so I usually uh, pick up a map even as weavy around and extensive as the one in this game And I've just played the game way too many times, so of course I know uh, exactly where I'm going all the time, which is uh, helpful. And it makes me kind of sad that I'm going to have to leave this map behind when the remake comes. Yeah, I've, I always uh, had a thing for for maps. There's just uh, something about maps that are just, uh, you know, exactly uh... Okay, so... Um, I have to return to Capella at some point. Oh yeah, I'm going on my way to get the brand. Okay. Um, and then I think I'm gonna go buy some twire from the worms. Yeah, I've been uh, watching the Kickstarter for a few years now. I've been pretty excited for the game. Um, that was originally why I started my Let's Play on YouTube of uh, the game was to uh, oops, drum up some interest in the game for uh, the remake. City. I'm gonna put you over here or you'll hopefully fall asleep now
Yeah, I, uh, I don't think that they... Well, we'll see if uh, we get the game at the end of this year or not. Um, it'd be nice, but I'd rather that they put their all into it and um, get everything, like, you know, perfect for uh, sending it out. Yeah, I wouldn't mind if it got delayed a little. That wouldn't uh, really, like... make a difference to me. Acquire a bunch of twire. Um, I mostly need the black twire for uh, trading. <laughs> what are you doing, pup? So I need 22. I already have 5. <coughs> okay. So I mostly need black twire. I grabbed all of those extra hearts, right? Okay, I did. I'll be able to buy all the twire that they have, which is pretty funny. They better have the black twire or I'm gonna be uh Oh there's a brown twire. And then there's one more that grows over by that rock sometimes. I don't see it though, so we're gonna head out to that worm. I'm gonna buy some twire, hopefully get rid of all these organs. Um Blood. So we can trade. Alright, 17 is exactly the amount that I need. Oh yeah, I forgot that they take food too. And I guess I could get the other... Uh, all of those if I can however many I can get I'll just give them all of them even if we're over a little 12 10 the crackers are worth 4 so that'd be perfect I can get one alright I didn't want to give them my food but That's okay. So now we have a lot of twire. I really won't need any twire the rest of the game. Oh, I'm gonna see what you guys said really quick. Um, I have a video up of my playthrough of the Marble Nest. It's on my YouTube. If anybody's interested. Um, I did okay on it. It was... I think it was my second run because the first run that I had um, I just ran around until I starved to death and I couldn't 
I just couldn't get anything done. Um, so the second time, I was just a little bit more methodical and got through it, so... Hi, Pop City. Hi. You're so happy now. Are you nice and full? Oh, now you look sleepy. We'll see if you fall asleep or not. <laughs> Um, I didn't like the, uh, way that, like, they, like, kept track of what was going on. It was, like, a idea map, or, like, an idea web, um, and it, it wasn't my thing. I'd prefer the quest log, where it's just kind of, like, you know, like, really brief notes about, like, what has been going on. Um, Cause, I mean, don't get me wrong, I hate it when a game, like, describes to you in, like, very excruciating detail exactly what you've been doing, and it's like, I don't need that, I just need the brief notes, like, or a list of names. Who have I seen today? <laughs> Who am I going to right now? Um, and I'd prefer that. Um, I didn't like, um, I don't know how to describe it, um, not really like the layout of the map, but just how, like, like this town, it's just like, Oh, I didn't grab the brand, so I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna put all this twire away, too. Usually I always carry the brown twire with me, but I don't need to, so I'm just gonna leave it all here. Um, but usually I... No, that's not the sentence I was going to say. Um, so I was talking about twire still, but... Back to the marble nest. Um, comparison of the town. The layout of this town is like very much like a real town. So it, it like makes sense where you're like going around and everything. It's like a real place. But in the marble nest, like things were just kind of too like sectioned off and it was kind of difficult to navigate. Um, and I just didn't like, uh, the feel of it in comparison, so um, not that I should have been comparing it, but um, oh, I have to go to Espina next, that's right. Um, but it was just, uh, I didn't like the way like things were like really quartered off. Because, yeah, on this map, like, sometimes you really had to go from, like, one corner to the other. But it's not, like, that significant. It doesn't, like... I'm, I don't really care when I have to walk from one end of the map to, up to the other, but... In that one, it, it just, like, if something was way on the other end, it was, like... Ugh. <laughs> Finding my way around was, like... It wasn't just, like, a... I didn't know the town, it was just like, not uh, great navigation, even if I did know it. Um, but I really liked a lot of the- oh, I'm, I'm not picking up any more organs, I don't want those anymore. But I really love the feel of what they've been putting out. Everything looks amazing. There's a hole under my heart. And I liked a lot of the dialogue. Some of it was a little weird. Like the feeling. Or just like what they would say. Like words, word usage or things like that. But um, overall I really liked that part of it.
I don't know. I feel like fences are like, um, I mean, like around here, like everybody has a fence around their house, like to the point of like it being ridiculous where like people like fight about their fences and like, or they'll have double fence. Like somebody will have already have a fence around their property and one like side of somebody's property is already fenced and they will put another fence along it. I've even seen places where like there was an old fence that didn't belong to either neighbor because somebody moved away so the neighbor put up a third fence so like one wall between their two houses have like there will be three fences between and in like a neighborhood like what is a fence like gonna do like somebody can just like these like four foot fences that like even I can scale where it's just like what is the point of this fence it's not like doing anything like I, I don't know just like fences fences were always a weird deal to me I was uh I grew up in a house that was one of the only like houses in a neighborhood that didn't have a fence so people would walk through our backyard all the time because it was like the only cut through in like the neighborhood and uh, my parents didn't like that, but other than that, like, it just seems more natural to just not have fences, especially in a neighborhood where it's like, what are you keeping out, really? What are you keeping out? <laughs> anyway, let us camp near the mountain, a suitable place. Let us camp next to the river, a suitable place. Um, what a strange coincidence. Do you know why I came? I can imagine. You're looking for the runaway. Oh, it's such a shame that Fat Vlad managed to weasel his way into your circle of friends. That friendship will do you no good. Oh no, but you're too late anyway. An outsider... Fop? A bachelor in a snakeskin coat came by poking his nose everywhere. I've led the runaway butchers into the steppe, otherwise he'd have shot them all dead. <laughs> Are they all gone? Some are hiding throughout the town. I'm planning to collect them one by one. I've ar I've found one already, and it won't take me too long to find the rest. The children of Suwak have no reason to expire in this torture chamber. You can count on me, Oinan. I won't let your people die. I'm not laughing about the text. My pup keeps making really funny noises in the background. Uh, but yeah, where is this one hiding? You wouldn't turn him into Fat Vlad, would you? Promise? I promise. Okay, I'll tell you. His hideout is in the place that anyone with two legs runs away from today. Look for him there, but be careful. He is being hunted. Don't let the hunters catch you too, because they won't waste their time trying to get to know you. Don't worry. What's the matter, pup? Are you whining? I'm gonna give him some other drops. Oops, as I, the cap just like rolled away from me. Here's something tasty. He's like eating it so lazily, like this is so delicious. And now his eyes are so wide. <laughs> and now we're sleepy lazy again. There you go. Now you're happy. You're so sleepy, just go to sleep. <laughs> you're so sleepy, just go to sleep. Okay. Back to the game. Oh yeah, I guess I have heard the word foppish. When I saw it, it was just fop. It was like, my brain just like... It's like, were, were, discreet error. Ah. 
so it's just some archaic language we don't really say anymore. You see it in like old books sometimes, but is the disease really it. contagious? Yes, it is, undoubtedly. Do you know what the Longmark brands mean? How could I? Women aren't allowed to know that. Pity. Shabnakadir is tracing the streets like bacteria in a vein. For our herders to pitch up their bark tents, for our shepherds to fill up their gullets. That's the uh, next line of the poem. Which somehow brings me back to Billy Joel. They cried when I saved again. What is this? I really have to start trading. <laughs> you walk through the town. Wow, it's only 9.30. And there are two quests that are already basically done. I just have to turn the one into Capella and I'm not doing the other one. So... That's pretty, uh, we're gonna have a lot of extra time today, I feel. Um, do I wanna, I have five silver rings. Do I wanna waste one on a shotgun shell? I do, but I feel like I should wait till an opportunity when one of these girls has a shotgun shell and a revolver bullet. Uh, okay, I'll wait. I'll wait. I don't wanna. I might repair my guns, depending on. Yeah, that one's only 300. Whoa! I didn't know my shotgun was so. F oh no, wait. That's not my shotgun. Just my revolver. I'm gonna sell that shotgun. <coughs> so that's the shotgun that uh, Notkin gave us for completing that one quest. And I'm sure if I repaired it for the 2k, it would probably sell for a lot more, but I'm just going to sell it. Okay, he didn't see it. Now I just have to loot the body before he sees. Okay, he didn't see anything. Probably because it's raining. There we go. What's the matter, Pupsity? Okay, I don't have any empty bottles. I don't think I was in the uh, bar yet today. Hey, you're one of the guys that I like to murder. Okay. Um, I have to double check where I'm going. Wow, the chat has almost completely failed <laughs> since I last looked. It's not every time I save, it's just like every like, I don't know, I don't think it's even a certain number, I think it's kind of random, which makes it even more creepy. My reputation hasn't actually been dropping for it though, it's just been weird. <laughs> I don't think it's a bug. I think it probably has something to do with like some other like internal counter cuz I know um you're supposed to get like something special if you don't open the map an entire playthrough and there's another one that I think you either don't save or it's like you get two saves. I don't remember. Whoa, I just saw a cat come out of nowhere. It 
It could just be because it's his run. I'm not sure. It's only happened, I think, twice the entire time I've been playing. So good thing I didn't turn this way. Because mm. I thought I was going to like one of these houses or something. That's Duke. Mm. Maybe I will repair that gun. And then I'll just turn around and sell it. wasn't ready for that. I don't remember what you're supposed to get if you don't open the map. I've just heard of it before. I haven't uh, actually uh, done that myself ever. Cause I always accidentally open the map. Yeah, it's it's a little worth it. I usually forget to repair them before I sell them, and I'll just sell them anyway. Um. <laughs> oh, you're just conning me for attention. I see. I come over here and you smile so big. I'm smiling so big. Yeah. <laughs> Is that so? Hi. Good night. Appears. There it is. I guess that gave this plague plagued individual more time to uh, come for me. <laughs> and I don't think the guard saw. Whoops. I needed the infected heart. you can get from any plague person. You don't have to go to the uh, cemetery to get the one that's um, part of the story. Okay, I can no longer sell that shotgun. So I'll sell the one that I had, I guess. I don't need to. I just don't. Oh, I can sell a knife too. Didn't I use one of these? Although I guess I could have gotten more for them a different day. Um, what was I coming through here for? Oh yeah, I have to go to that house. I keep forgetting that we're playing day three. Okay, um, let's see. What are you up to, Pup City? Make 
making all kinds of noises. He looked really sleepy for a little while there, and uh, now he looks pretty wide awake. Oh, and now he's looking sleepy again. Okay. So hopefully he'll fall asleep soon. Okay. I might raid the house a little first. I haven't gone in the shop yet, have I? Or did I just go in it? Brain. Oh no, I came here this morning. That's right. Yeah, I already got those needles. Yeah, there were two here this morning. That's right. I was in the other shop. That's the one I was thinking of. Why I thought I was in a shop. Okay, so the butcher's upstairs. Ah. <laughs> As I get stuck on the doorway. Pretty just guaranteed that I'm going to uh, get infected. Oh no, I don't remember where he is. I thought he was in this room. Okay, I'm just gonna run around and find him first. So I thought that if I get stuck on a doorway, Let's see if there's anything in here too, I guess. I thought he was through there. And I'm just not seeing him. I was positive he was upstairs here somewhere. Oh, he's in this room. Okay. I just remembered this, like, kind of bluish color. And that he was upstairs. I can put on this pair of gloves and I can eat all these lemons. And I could I could take a, this mixture as well. I have to get food. Oh my goodness. My hunger is like full. So I'm gonna go to the food shops at the end of the street um, after this. Why did you come, a child of Bodho? What are you doing here? I want to ask you about the Longmark. I have no knowledge of the circles of Longmark. I am neither an Oinon, nor a Menku, nor a Shaman. Tell me what this brand means. You're an Oinon of a Menku, Ken, are, are you not? I've seen this brand, bef brand before. I don't know the lines. Um, I've seen it in a terrible place. There is a corridor in the depths of the abattoir. The route that Supremes take when they come from the steppe to be celebrated. Oyun, the foreman of the abattoir, can explain the meaning to you. Supremes? You don't know who Supremes are? You're joking. Tell me. You are joking. You cannot be called by name, for they are not to be talked about. They cannot be called by name. What next? Are you going to tell me you don't know of the one that is called Boss Turok? Are you talking about gods? Yes, among other things. Don't play jokes on me, Oinon. Don't make fun of me just because I am a simple man. What's the matter, pup? You're going crazy over here. I might have to give him some more ginger water. Oh, man. <laughs> Oh yeah, I wasn't. A, I, well, it was interesting how they did the infected houses. Um, it's definitely different, and I like 
that it's different. Um, but you know, I definitely liked the way the Plague Clouds were in this game, so I'm hoping that they do like a big mix where there are just a ton of different kinds of Plague Clouds instead of locking us into one kind or another. Because that would be interesting if you just had to think on your feet all the time whenever you see a Plague Cloud and try and uh... you'd have to know like how to deal with that kind and um, think on your feet as you like avoid it in its specialized manner. <laughs> I'm giving my pup more ginger water. Are you choking? Are you choking on the ginger water? <laughs> there. Yeah, I usually try to save a lot to avoid infection in these houses, too. Yeah, the infection houses- the infected houses looked very sparse. I- I just think that's because they haven't gotten into it yet. Um, some of the details. That's probably something that they're not gonna overlook in the future. Maybe they're just saving it, too. I don't really like the inventory system either, but that's just because it's like more limited than this one. You just you get to hold so many items in this one, so that's like nice. Um, I don't like having to run back to boxes a lot, but we'll see like how much of an issue it is as like when the game comes out. Infected food would be interesting. Oh, uh, there are no gross clumps of meat. That's too bad. I've seen images somewhere of instead of clumps of meat, it's actually dead bodies in the street. And I was wondering if that was like a particular version that maybe the English version, they thought we were too soft for that. And if maybe like in the Russian version they have that, because I always see those pictures here and there, but it's definitely not like a, some, a setting you can toggle in the game. I've only ever had the English version though. all the ginger water I should give you right now. Yes, among other things. Don't play jokes on me, Oina. Don't make fun of me just because I'm a simple man. I already read that. What else can you tell me about the sign? If something is marked with the sign, then it is neither a man nor a child of Badho nor a Suak. Of Suak. It's a supreme. What you need is not a man, Oinan. Your father had something to do with those who walk the corridor. It scares me. The brand is drawn there for a reason. They are not men. That is all I know. Well, thanks anyway. I don't think I got infected. I think it just hit my immunity, but we'll have to find out. Whoops. Um, I can't tell if I'm a sliver infected or not. I just can't tell. I'm gonna have to wait. If I am, then I'll just, uh... Run around and be silly for a while. Oh my goodness.
That was like when two semis are side by side on the highway. And they're going really slow. I guess I'll just buy everything because I need food. Well, I guess I, c I have two lockpicks, so maybe I'll just buy what I need right now. Which I don't really need that much. We're almost done with the day, so I could lockpick into a house. I can't tell if I'm infected. I know it kind of looks like there's a little bit of a red sliver there, but I just can't tell. Should I just redo it anyway? I think I will. Since we're right here. Maybe I'll use the mixture that I have when I go in this time. Let's see, what did I have again? I have gloves and I can eat all these lemons. the lemons that did me in on my hunger meter. And I definitely got infected. It's like it's waiting for me right there. I shouldn't be standing outside and doing this, but... Okay. I should draw it away downstairs or something. Oh, it's not there this time. I guess I could have said something different this time. I've already read all this, so I didn't think about it. Do, 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 do. There was like no plague cloud that time. That's kind of funny. Now watch me like walk into one like out here or something. Something really stupid. There are two that are come here if it's the same as last time. I think I was infected that first time. Yeah, I'd rather not get infected if I don't have to, um, cause I could always waste a powder, but this time I got hazelnuts. That's so exciting. I'm so happy that I checked in here. Oh my goodness. So happy. Fantastic. Um. So I have to go talk to Capella and Big Vlad. And I think that Daniel has our um, other quest today. So... I think I might... Hmm. 
Well, I'll go talk to Capella and Big Vlad, of course. Alright, yeah, Brand is the main quest for the day, so... Um, that'll be done pretty soon. And we can, uh... Run around and be silly. Is Daniel's quest the longest today? Um... I don't know. trade with. Hopefully I can. I have a ton of trade items. Well, that's not what I want to trade for. So I might just run around and try to trade with uh, kids for a little while. Oh, really? <laughs> well, if it gets really bad, I can uh, reset my internet again. Um, I meant to change... Um, I can change my stream setting. Um, so that it doesn't focus on quality. I don't know why I would want to focus on quality anyway. Um, and hopefully the stream will like buffer less and stuff, so we can try that for future days. Because I meant to do that, but I don't think I actually changed it. I don't know if I needed that Meridorm. I'm just not sure. Kills this lady. What is my reputation? Hmm. No, I'll kill her just yet. Ooh, it would be nice if we could get a powder, right? Right? Come on, I have so many hazelnuts. Please have a powder. Please. It's hard for us to believe in things that has it, lie outside of our scope. Has it been hard on you lately? I'm not exactly sure what happened. Your dear Notkin was attacked by some bandits. Ah, and? Calm down, he's fine. Thank you. What have you done with the bandits? I've killed them. I had to. But you have helped Notkin. Would you please allow me to thank you? I can't refuse a gift from you. 3,000. Nice. Bachelor is dragging the children out of the dangerous districts. Those districts are infected, aren't they? Um, yeah, my exhaustion's getting a little high. I don't need to be saving this much. <laughs> The girl is fine, but the boy... <laughs> the boy's unbearable. I'm glad you are still alive. I wanted to speak to Foreman Oyen. Can you arrange that? What? What Oyen? With, why with the Foreman? What Foreman? The current one? Yes, the current one. Oyen. Have the, have the mistresses told you about him? 
Yeah, I've lost one friend called Barack already. And Foreman Oyun knows why. Yes, he will pay for it. Anyway, I don't want to lose another. He knows who killed my father? He does. He knows alright. Allow me to say I'm pretty sure he's not unhappy about your father's death. Oyun, that is. He wouldn't be unhappy if you were to die either. No, there's no reason for you to meet him right now. I want to see him. He went off to the step. He's not in town at the moment. I think he's supposed to come back in a day or two. When did he leave? Three days ago. Maybe four. Exactly on the eve of your arrival, Master Barak. So will you arrange for us to meet? There's a plot being woven against me. The bachelor's nosing about the termitary and abattoir. If I meet the foreman, I'll give him another reason to suspect me. It'll all be fine. It will all settle in time. But I wouldn't be so keen on meeting him if I were you. Thank you for the advice. Simon has disappeared. So his death was... Another prank? Well, let's not be hasty, in our judgment. Okay. Save. That's not the button I wanted to press. So we're done with the day quest. I did one quest. Daniel has the other one, but I don't think he's sent us anything yet. Should I lockpick into this house? Is this a good house to lockpick into? I don't know. I'm gonna see what everybody's saying really quick before I go in. Um, I had, I had some issues when I was trying to play the game full screen, so that's why I have it windowed and I have it a little smaller, um, it just, uh, was kind of buggy and I had weird things. Yes, I do need to update OBS, <laughs> so <coughs> that is something that I should do. Um, maybe I'll do that tonight. Um, it wasn't anything uh, with the streaming when it was full screen. Um, it was with the game itself. I couldn't run it full screen for some reason. It it just always crashes out. Olgimski well, is a cool name. Crackers. I guess it's not worth it to invoke his wrath over crackers. Okay, there's nothing in this house so far. There's a lady that I could murder. That's something that's in this house. Other than that, whoops, there's a little girl that I could trade with, no. I mostly wanted food, so if I don't find any food in this house, I'm not going to uh, save this. Just because it's happened once before, I'm going to double check that uh, our ki kitchens didn't reset what food is in there. Getting out of here. 
powder. That would definitely change my mind about this place. Well, that was quite a bit. Bread. Two coins leaves it. I guess I could trade for some of these. Whoops. I will trade a watch. Well, I got a bunch of trade items. And there's a little girl that I could attempt to get a powder from, so I'll save. I'll make a few attempts for a powder. Um, if it starts to take too long, then I'll give up. Oh. <laughs> well. <laughs> That's a thing. bread. Should I go for the crackers? <coughs> Apparently I shouldn't have. Oops. I thought the door was on the other side for a second. How did I survive that punch? Riddle me that. Do I have one HP left? Honestly? I'd be surprised if I did. <laughs> I probably have enough bullets now that I could start actually shooting people to kill them. <laughs> you know, that one game mecha mechanic that exists. Oh no, it's, so it's not working that great right now. Um, I at, at least I'm just doing side stuff right now. Um, although you probably don't want to miss me getting powders and stuff. Because that's always exciting. <laughs> or murdering those guys in the street. I know you don't want to miss that. Do a powder check first. Then I might trade with the this girl and there's a little boy around the corner. And then I'm going to murder that guy. Say. Well, I have to wait till that little kid gets far away enough because I don't want him to go after me for this. Down. You don't want this red coat to kill you. Oh look, there's another powder girl. Oh, she's walking the other way. Have a powder for me! I have enough for two more. I 
Have I gone in that shop yet today? Is that another murdered guy? Murder victims just lining up. <laughs> oh, another girl. Probably Daniel's letter that we got though. No, it's from Reuben. Oh, I got an invitation from The Bachelor. Reuben keeps threatening. They try to convince me that they're that you are not guilty. I'd like to believe this, but I cannot. Your advocates reek of self interest and deception. Not the kind of peacemakers I'd trust. The harder they try to acquit you, the more suspicious I get. Where are you hiding? That's from Reuben. Another invitation from The Bachelor. Came upon difficulties of a very peculiar sort. They keep obstructing my work with their con their consent. Constant? Oh my goodness. References to local superstition. I don't think I'll manage without your assistance. Please come see me if you can. I will be working in the premises where I stay. I know I do have like one HP. <laughs> yeah. If I like trip on the ground, I'll die. Hmm, yeah, I, I don't uh I don't have any audio sh issues on my end either. That's kind of, uh, interesting. Um, I can... <sighs> so I don't know if I should try to start and- or stop and start the stream, or if that would help at all. <laughs> See what Daniel wants today. Truth does not do as much good in the world as the appearance of truth does evil. I was happy at first that it wasn't bubonic plague, now I realize I would have rather preferred it. So you've begun studying the disease, I gather. I have, and you actually. You can help me with that. Tell me, is it true there are special people in the local community? The only ones who have the er, moral right to pierce others, even the dead, with tools? Yes, you're talking about Menku. They're butchers and wardens. That is their right. But it's not about morals. What is it about, then? Allow me to kindly remind you that there are a lot of people here who do not shy away from piercing others with knives in the street. Yet during an emergency, the people who look more or less modern and civilized are disallowing me, a fully trained medic, to s d dissect bodies. It's an ancient tradition. Its roots are religious in nature, or even uh, myth mythological. Bloody brilliant. Well, I don't profess any local religion. I'm fighting an epidemic, or rather I'm trying to save a couple thousand people even though they turn themselves inside out, doing their best to get in my way. They won't let you dissect the dead? Exactly. I need tissues of a, a person who died of the sand plague. I need them today. Right now. I've tried to get them at the cemetery, but failed miserably. The patrolmen are vig vigilantly watching over the dead. Will this sample do? Damn. Are you sure the tissue belongs to a person who died of the sand plague? I am. I killed them. <laughs> I need it so bloody much. How did you know? A little bird told me. Was this little bird Reuben? Reuben doesn't speak to me, Oinon. Seems like he still believes that I'm guilty of par patricide. I can remedy that. I would be very grateful. Good luck with the tissue. <laughs> Please allow me to return the favor. 
Here are the medical supplies that are not available to the general public publicly yet. Public yet. I can give them to you. I can give them all to you. So choose what you want most. Immunogens, antibiotics, or painkillers. I think the painkillers sell for the most. Do I get a um Oh, I can't remember if I get the purple ones or not. So I don't think I do, so I'm gonna go for the painkillers because they sell the most. Sell for the most. I think that's what I usually go with. You look unhealthy. Oh, thanks. I was happy at first that it wasn't bubonic. Oh, he already said I read that. I want to ask you something going on. Something very important. It's about a panacea. What are you talking about? The serum? Yes, tell me how to extract antibodies from tissue. First of all, they have to be there. If you're sure they are, then there are several general ways to go from there. A serum, after all, is just a blood component. As far as I understand, you can mix a sample of it with those natural agents. We'll need to get a sample first, though. Then go ahead, experiment. Right, an experiment like this has been successful once before. So I've heard, your father was a natural, so what did you want to ask, ask of me? When you get down to studying a tissue sample, please see if there are antibodies in it. I have no intention to hide my results from you, obviously, but regrettably I have serious doubts that they are going to make you happy. It doesn't look like a human organism can resist the disease at all. At least that's what I've been st seeing so far, sadly. Yet my father's endeavors were a success. That's all I'm hoping for. Don't worry. I'll tell you of my findings. The first results will become available as soon as tomorrow. Thank you. Okay, so that, uh... Hmm. I didn't, uh, even list Daniel's quest in my quest log because I finished it when I talked to him. So... <laughs> It didn't even get listed. That's hysterical. So I won't even be able to... The crying when I save again. But I won't be able to remember that I did his quest. Oh wow, yeah, that's gonna be really hard. Yeah, I definitely uh, really enjoy talking to everybody while streaming, so that makes it really enjoyable. Um, it's too bad that today we've had such issues with the stream. Hopefully this whole weekend isn't like that. That would be a bummer. Hmm. Cause I, I can see the, uh, the stream so I have OBS open, so at the bottom it's in the green, um, so it should be running just fine, so I don't think it's actually on my end this time. Um, Cause some of the other times when you guys were having issues it was in the red or it was orange, or at least yellow, but right now it's like totally good, so hopefully it'll catch up. Um, well I have technically finished the day so I could uh, stop for today and do a longer one tomorrow hoping that it'll be a bit better or do you do you want me to um, keep trying to uh, to reset and play more Well, I don't have to end. Usually I go through uh, and at least watch the end of the day video before I end, so... Um... I don't know if I... want to do some more running around like that.
Let's see what time it is. Oh yeah, because it's only noon in the game, so there's a lot of day left. Um, do you guys want to see the rest of the day, or should I just uh, get it up to uh, the end of the day video for next time? Is that that's quite a bit of running around that I'm gonna have to do. Cause it's only 12.30. Hmm, <laughs> okay. Well, I think... I'll try running around for a little bit, um, at least until I can sleep, because that'll get rid of a bunch of time. Um, and hopefully it'll stay green. Hopefully the stream has caught up since I've just been sitting here for a while. Um, so I'll do- I'll run around for a little while and uh, collect items and- well I guess if I- well I, I have to do a little bit of trading so- um, I will just run around for a little while, and then we'll sleep and go for that end of the day video. Cause I guess it's it's only been a two hour stream, so if I do a lot on the next one, it might be a longer one. Whoops. I've been in the shop yet. Good, I need them. Um... Mm. Oh, I was gonna say it turned red again. Oh no, but it, it was only red for a second. Now it's back to green. So I'll just kind of try to pay attention to that. And if it's red while something important is happening, I'll just wait. But it's been in the green like almost this whole time, so there's just that second it turned red. turned yellow for a second, but it was just a second. So it, it seems like it's gonna stay good. Hopefully. <laughs> I definitely um, would like to break into another house. <laughs> 
This is gonna make my reputation go below half. So I won't be able to buy food until I do some quests tomorrow. Oh, I guess tonight I can kill a bunch of thugs. So that'll help. See if that one guy's body is still there. Cause they've been disappearing on me lately. In the original, they didn't ever disappear as long as you didn't go inside a house. But in this one, my dead body is gone. So that's one thing I absolutely do not like about the HD version. That body shouldn't have disappeared like that. Like, that's crazy. Um, in the original, you could run all around the town and come back and your body would still be there as long as you didn't go inside. I might lock quick into one of these houses this time. up a space. That's a girl up there. I might stop to trade with her. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna break into one of the houses over here. Okay, we were we're in the red right now. So you may not be able to see what's going on. Free bottles of water. <laughs> what I really need is food. So I better get some. Unfortunately, it means that if I don't get food in this house, that I am going to have to, uh... <laughs> I'm gonna have to get another lockpick somewhere if I can't get any food in here. Um, I got some fish, so it's not all for not. I just wish I had gotten a bit more. 
The powder was a good score, though. Oh yeah, so it hasn't been good, because it's been in the green for like most of the time, so... I'm just not sure if it's a... Uh... Was red right there. And now it's back to green. trade with that girl over there and she ran away because I'm a bad person. I definitely cannot buy things in shops anymore. <laughs> so... this. I guess if I do that I can get everything. I can always sell the rifle bullets. I've been in the green this whole time, so... Not sure, not sure. If it's been going pretty good, then uh... That would be uh, what we're looking for, but... Not sure. <laughs> I have been getting pretty lucky with the powders. Um, no, the shopkeepers don't attack you, they just don't. S oh, yeah, you just answer the question in the next line. So, uh, yeah, if you have low reputation, you just can't buy anything, so. You just have to, uh, be careful about that. <laughs> um, I don't think I need any more Merit Orms, so... I'll get rid of a watch. Get the, some more yellow tablets. How many of those do I have? 
18. We have quite a bit of time before I have to, um, have all of those, so. I'm going to eat what I have. Um, I find one of those bigger houses. I went into this one before. Is it still unlocked? Yes, it is. I'm just curious because that one time one of the houses that I kept entering kept replenishing food. And I've never had that happen before. It must have just been that house or maybe that house that day. Um, these are bigger houses, so I guess I'll lockpick into one of these. I just wanted to save before I did it. So that's why I saved in that other house. All these lemons, jeez. That's pretty nice. I just have to get food now. Ah, this is really nice. Wow, there was a lot in here. That was quite a haul. Definitely saving this. Okay. Oh, he just happened to not see me look. <laughs> Whoops. Oh. I'm gonna get punched to death, aren't I? Did he get stuck somewhere? in this house. This was crazy. I already saved, but I'm saving again. Yeah, this was the kitchen. I don't even need to uh, take what's in there because I just got so much in this house. This was crazy. Yeah, they were stacked. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Barack is stacked. This playthrough has been so fruitful. Like, 
This is crazy how much stuff um, we were able to get this time. Like That house was just so loaded. Um, it wasn't even a three-story house. Imagine if there had been a whole other story that I could have looted. when it's stuff that I want. Um, I think that I'm gonna go for the really big houses that are over here next. I definitely want to go for a third floor. And then after that I might sleep. If I sleep for six hours, then uh, we will uh, be able to end the day. see really quick. Oh yeah. Yeah, well, thanks for tuning in. You won't be missing much, just me running around, so... Especially if the stream isn't, uh, holding up well. It's too bad that it, uh... That it wasn't, uh, cooperating for us today. <laughs> Very unhappy. It's a bad day. Yeah, good night. Thanks for joining us. Um, I might uh, end the stream since uh, it's not going. It's not been uh, buffering so well, so I think I'm gonna just uh, run around, loot a house or two more, and then sleep. Actually, this looks like it's gonna be my house, because I just got food, so that's what I came here for. Oh shoot. Yep. So, hopefully that house will still have food in it when I reload here. <laughs> uh, we'll see. I didn't even see that kid.
Papa's sneezing away. Hopefully. Okay, it didn't seem like he saw me that time. For whatever reason. After this house, I'm definitely gonna um, just sleep and then end the day. Wow, empty. My pup is not very happy. Epidemic alert. That's gotta be exciting. Alright, let's see what's in here for us. Nothing. Nothing. Oh, fish, good. And a coin. Yeah, my pup's not happy. So I'd like to end soon. He's really working up. I'll go sleep and then uh, I'm going to uh... so we're right by Lara's. I'm gonna sleep at her house and then uh... We'll go do the end of the day video, and that's it for the day. Oh wow, Lara's is locked today. It's because of my reputation. So I have to go somewhere else. Okay. Go sleep at Capella's house. That's the house that's the closest to the entrance to the theater anyway. So, uh... Yeah, we'll sleep and... Then I can end the day. Starting to work up. Let's see if uh, I can get in. No, women won't attack you for uh, stealing. It's just the men that will. <laughs> oh. starting to work up. Well, I might end the stream here. Um, and we'll just, uh, we'll get to the end of the day video in the next one. So we'll start our video with it next time. Thanks for tuning in. It was, uh, fun to talk to everybody as always. So I will... Um, continue tomorrow. Bye.